In the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. So, this is the way how we are going to commence. I am the uh, you are our first time at least. Please talk. I am the resurrection and the life. He that believeth in me, though he were dead, yet shall he live. And whosoever liveth and believeth in me shall never die. Believest of this? For we brought nothing into this world, and in his said, we can carry nothing out. Naked came I out of my mother's womb, and naked shall I return thither. The Lord gave, and the Lord has taken away, and the God of our comfort, who comforted us in all our tribulation, that we may be able to comfort them which are in any trouble by the comfort wherewith we ourselves are comforted of God. Amen. Amen. We are going to be singing and we are going to initiate and we are going to sing the first song and the cobra. Glory to God. And that song is the Lord's my shepherd.
here are ready for us to first listen until we give thanks to God. Amen. Amen. Can we bless the Lord? Amen. We worship the Lord. Amen. And that really was from Psalm 90, 1 Now we are going to have a selection from the Island Holiness, Wesleyan Holiness Church. So, uh, this will be done right away from the Green Island Church.
Nor I want to say to you, my friends and brethren, if you are in Dutch for 30 years or even more, and your life is not right with God, you are going to be a It will be a soft cry, and the soft cry you are going to hear, depart from me, I know you not. Regardless how we as preachers, I say we as preachers, try to preach your body. We are the true father. There shall be life. You don't believe that. Now we have different kind of trees on this land. And if you talk about the natural trees, we have great food, we have coconut, cedar, mahogany, and all different kinds of trees. And when those trees fall down, men can lift them and put them at another place where you want them. But here it is. Where, when it comes to man, the direction that the man falls, well, only two directions. A tree can fall in any direction out of the forest. Do you know what are the two directions? Hell and heaven. Glory to God. The Bible says the tree falls toward the east or toward the north. In the place where it falls, there it shall die. But I am saying, for you and I, we can only fall one of two directions. And when we fall, Nobody can remove us from the direction that we found. Amen? Amen? So as I said, it must be heaven or hell. So, I must remind you, there is no repentance after death. Have you here with us a minister, a good gentleman, who is going to share with us a few words Oh, glory to God. And this man is by the name of Pastor Bowie. I don't make it known, but Pastor Bowie, when I live in your life, I don't want to give you my word. God bless you, sir. Amen. 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 Amen.
and I didn't have a problem with the spear. So I had to postpone it. I plan again, but thanks be to God, I'm in Negrim. Amen. And I'm now in Hanover for the very first time. The first time is the only parish in Jamaica preacher that I've ever been to. I have a good friend, passed on some years ago, Pastor Pickford. Pastor in a church somewhere on the hill there. Thank God. Amen. Amen. Praise the name of the Lord. And the funny thing also is that my mother's, some of my mother's family is from an orphan. But I have never been here. But nevertheless, we thank God for today. The occasion may not be an happy one for the family or the community. But it is the reality of life that we must deal with. And the Bible declares that man that is born of a woman have a very but short time to live. And listen to this, is full of trouble. So if you think that the problem that you are going through, it should not have been preached. The Bible says you are full of trouble. And sometimes the trouble is not only on the outside, but the trouble is right at yard. I don't want to do worse one now. Because when you can't get rid of outside trouble, you can't get rid of yard trouble unless you run away. Come on, talk with the church. Praise the name of the Lord. But the Bible tells us that man of an alternative. And the alternative that we have is that we have to see a friend Amen. before we leave one. <laughs> now one preacher preached to it, pastor. And the friend that you need to see is not the scamming friend. Hear me, let me tell you something. Yes, in the church of the pastor, when you go here, Amen. one preacher, grown up two preachers, you know, a good friend. He tell me, say, boy, oh, where you gone? He said, man, Shalim. He said, man, nobody now sent me a bush to run and make knives. And if we go a man, Shalim, and we can drop down, we now stop running to the left. He said, man, sweet God, and I said, please, man. And when I get to find out the place preachers, I, I carry my family, I carry my wife with me. I carry my son. Come on, I preach me, I'm preaching. I'm going to say, I carry my son. I carry my little baby. So I carry my vulnerable folks with me. I drop in a place where I invest it with coke. Man, I get left, right, and center every day. My God Almighty. Amen. I said, God, are you sent me? Yes. I jump in a long place full of revival, pomina, and witchcraft. Amen. Preacher, I had a fight. But thanks be to God. The hot body battle. Hallelujah. The sweet body victory. Because man must know that there is a God in Israel. Only if you're heading the house of God and give him a praise of God. Hallelujah! When you come to preach, man, man was supposed to have smile and a skin deep. When you preach, man must be on your knees because the Bible says there is no repentance offered unto the dead. Amen. No pardon. No pardon. Amen. No repentance in the grave. So here we are. I said the church must preach. Show me if I get back. Show me if I get out the hand. And the church sometimes we are compromised because we get free. Yes, it's silent, sir. Amen. Hallelujah. Come on, mothers 
of Zion, where are the weak women? Amen. Where are the women of Zion to tie our belly and to weep before the altar of God? Where are the women to come and posture before the courts of the Lord? And cry out for our nation, Jamaica. But we come and we clap our tiny hands for joy. And our son and our grandson, they man dead and go hell. Bible said, blow the trumpet in Zion. One of the women every week, the big boss, the rolling man, about every, every week, big part and mother, about pan and what have you. And one night, them come in front of the church. And let me tell you, when they put up the flag, and when they spin on cheek, I say, God, me and keep service, me now lock up church. And when they are 19, turn up, man. Me never know when they, me and they never swear them off. Keep them in church of God. Stand for you, brother, watch, man. If God said it, not to be for his sin. Time to put in the nation. Come on, church of God. You have a work to do in Psalm Spring. Hallelujah. Amen. And when they turn up, they come and borrow some cheer from the church. They lend them the cheer. They lend them the cheer. They lend them all of the cheer. But guess what I'm preaching? We start to preach Bible. Now. And after we start to preach Bible, man I get begs. Deacons that the force of hell, demons turn up preacher. Lord God Almighty, had it not been for God. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 I should have fallen. I'm a short cast. But thank God for mercy. Bless the name of Jesus. Bless the name of Jesus. Bless the name of Jesus. Pastor William Lewis, when he tell me, said, Preacher, you come here just come and we didn't tell before, but we are going to feed around. He said, I come to come through her, man, so we are coming with you. Amen. Amen. When I come, Bishop said, Pastor, you can't bring me, said, Pastor, the doctor ready for any appointment. Amen. So, okay, okay, Pastor, you have to do it with one notice. One week notice. And if you're doing what is with me, you should disrespect me. Be preacher. Come on, talk to me, somebody. Own yourself now. Amen. You know, the mighty and the God, and He will exalt you in this season. Praise the name of the Lord. Amen. That being said, let me give God the praise and let me give God the honor. Yes. I obviously have never met this gentleman. I don't know him. And I don't know what profession. He is. But he must have had a profession in life. Because I see on the program that daughter. So be sure if a man start having woman, that means he must have something to support woman and take him. Come on, man. So he must have a profession. Hallelujah. So he would have lived and worked. And he's not an old man from what I'm seeing on the program. A big man, but not an old man. The Lord has seen fit to call him old. Family, let your heart be straight. Be straight. Amen. Amen. Praise the name of the Lord. The Lord. You will mourn and you will cry. Yes. But God will be here. Amen. Oh, praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. But Church of God, I want to say to us that in this life we are making preparation for our house and our home and the place in which we dwell. Why? Because when our friends and our family come, we, we don't want to feel small. We don't want to that kind of come and Jamaican people proud of Jamaican people proud. So when a friend comes, they want to know that the place is stable. 
Come on, talk to me now. You see, when we, when we go foreign in a preacher, and we show some foreign and we, we don't know them something like Jamaica. I've seen something lately, we see some people these years, they sit down and watch TV and watch the, the YouTube and the internet and the same place where they eat and let them play right and the same. I said the same place for them to eat, they left the dish right at the same side. But the place we fix up and look good. Why? Because our surrounding, or the place and our surrounding state, as our mindset state. When you see a man the place now ask and chatter chatter, you know you want to ask what kind of man that is. Master Builder. 
So the Bible says that by faith now, Abraham is not seeing but look with the church of God. He's going to use the eyes of faith to discern where his destination is. Oh, good God Almighty. And when Abraham begin to look through the spirit, the Bible says that Abraham see as he saw as Come on, talk with me, church of God. Now the Bible says that the art form the, the, the structure will be. Because he, he went into the subterranean structure of the building. Come on, somebody, the foundation right, the building can write. Amen. Truly. So it says, our foundation. The foundation. Hallelujah. Who's built? And make it is God. Hallelujah. If you're in the house, I'm going to give you my praise. Mr. Neal would have lived somewhere, I'm sure he was living out the door. He lived in a house. Yes. And that was his house. But it is no more. No more. So we have to take our eyes, Church of God, from the things that are temporal. That only lasts for a time. Yes. To think about the more enduring aspect of our life. Amen. The spiritual side. Thank you, Bishop. So he said, it have foundation. Yes. And who's builder Amen. and maker God. is God. Oh, give him a high praise. In the house. Give him a high praise. In the, house. in the name of Jesus. Paul wrote, and he said, as a wise master builder, I've laid a foundation. Parents, what kind of foundation we have laid? Mothers, fathers. What are the foundation we are laying for our posterities? What are we passing on to them? Truly, we desire for better for all of our children. We desire that our children will do better than us. So if you was a farmer, you want your son or your daughter to become a lawyer, a teacher, yes. a nurse, or an engineer. If you want to become better. Yes. And if you use a drum on the truck and go on market, you will sell you want him to do. So you want him to drive him on the truck and go sell him if that's what you want to do. But you want him to be better. Amen. Come on, church of God. Amen. So Paul said as a wise master builder. I've laid a foundation. Amen. And then the pattern, we must take cognizance of the fact that whatever we are putting on the foundation must be substance that will endure. Oh, praise the name of the Lord. Lift your hand and give him a praise, somebody. Praise him in the house, somebody. If it's only the temporal things, the gold and the silver, the land and the house. Yes. That is going to fear. Yes, that is going to diminish. Amen. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Bless the, bless the name of Jesus. So when we are laying a foundation, we must lay it upon the man with the plan. All thanks be to God. And the Bible says that there comes he was born of a virgin Mary. The Bible said to all a virgin in the book of Isaiah shall bring forth a son. And they shall call his name wonderful, counselor, the mighty God, the prince of peace, the everlasting father. Find a shelter for your soul. Your foundation 
foundation is stable. Amen. If the foundation is right, the building is quiet, as Jamaica would say. Amen? Amen. The quiet. Preacher is stable. Amen. It's out of shape. Yes. Oh, thanks be to God. Amen. Thanks be to God. Amen. So as we journey through life, there are storms of life that will face us. But when we have a foundation that is secure, when the storm comes, we still will be standing. Oh, praise the name Amen. of the Lord. When the storm is over, we will still be standing. Amen. Why? Because I am standing here only because God kept me. Amen. Only if your hand and give him a praise. Amen. Give your hands and give him a praise. So when you were the wise man, start to ask some question. And before you answer, I'm going to tell you what you did. He said, when you did, he don't no, 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 in the book of Revelation, chapter 21, John said, I saw, I John, yes. saw a new heaven, new and a new heaven. Yes. For the former things have passed away. Amen. Passed away. Amen. And the old
together yes. to say we are preaching because it will come to an end. One of these days, everything will come to an end. So we praise the God who made the heaven and the earth Amen. because he lives forever and ever. Amen. Oh, bless the Lord. Bless the name of the Lord. Amen. 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 Thank you, Pastor Boyle, for these wonderful words. And may the God of heaven continue to bless you. We have a lot of gods in the earth, but one God is above all the gods. So we see him as God of gods and Lord of lords. He is the conquering lion of the tribe of Judah. The one who said, let there be light, and there was light. Glory of the Lord for one more day. Amen. Amen. Just a few days ago, we were in the old year. Now we are in the new year. And none of, none of us can say what to our home. We don't know. One thing I know, our lives, our life is in God's hands. Amen. 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 I was looking for Pastor Williams, but he will be in our final word for us. I want to say to the friends and to the brethren, a big thank you for coming before we close. So, we are still moving on. So, before we should close the service, we want to leave you there. Two last items. Amen. 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 Glory to God. Bless the name of the Lord. Amen. Amen. So are we moving on? We are moving on. And so I have to say to God, to God, in glory, we have the sermon. Now we need to have a new logic. Happy New Year to everyone.
today I want to thank to Mr. Foster, that is Steve Foster, Miss Pearl Foster Edwards, because they are able to come and Sister Paulette and the others. They asked me to work for them. I go charge everybody who suffer because they said friendship should be choose for quality and not for quantity. Because the worst miser is the person who doesn't give love. And if the grass were greener on the other side, why is they stop giving money? I was sitting okay. beside Mr. James, this one who know me from I was a little girl. I used to be with them, ten men, one little girl. Nobody asked me, nobody touched me up, just one little girl, and it's me. To the day, I salute you for help taking 50 dollars, 50 cents, paper 50 cents. Remember the paper 50 cents? Mm -hmm. He helped along the school. They said, when you have a friend, you must know your friend. Because some of these is no friend. You only like cheap gossip. And cheap gossip bring your pain. Bring your disgrace. Bring your stress. But when you look, and qualities, they will cherish you, they will teach you, they will guide you. Two people inside here today where they are my role model. Can you know with those people? Mr. and Mrs. Spears. The day somebody wants to marry to me, and I cannot live like those people, stay with your ring, because I don't want it. But you're not going to come and box me, you're not going to come and kick me, no. You're going to come and show me TLC, loving, tender care. No giving no wrong. I know, no, 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 Until I find myself before my pastor God take him home. Remember me tell her, no, 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 can't tell her in the church, you know. This is my room and the wife over there. Remember, no, no, no. Because you see when you send, when you carry somebody in a church, just like when you carry a child for a faith for Christmas, you not just let them go, you feel your feet to you know. You understand? That means to say you find out if you, if you have lunch money, how you never react. Put on your clothes when you come at church. You know, just so big that my father and my father left him. You understand? So, I don't know if encourage me, you know. But it's my pastor over there, so. And if you're even dead, it's your wife over there, so. So, you see, two me know without me, him today, we put on the dress. So, you, that's why we show you respect. Respect was too many to in the house of God.
other name, so I can say that these are open tributes. So we have one, two, and three. So we have a wish to and each person will be doing about three minutes. <laughs> Are you first, everyone?
fire leash on everywhere, run green island. No. The long and short of it, I don't want to go ahead of the eulogy. But there are speculations, a lot of allegations about Baldwin. We were in Sri Lanka for four years. I had a misfortune and I went to Sri Lanka to straighten out my life. This young man is in here. He lived an excellent life in Sri Lanka. I told him to come home. He didn't. A very proud young man. And because I'm crying by him. But you know what I want to end and say? Sometime, the family member they must lend me half of the funeral money. Just let me have. You understand? Let me have before we did. Have a good day. Okay, Mr. Sparky. So, right on the side, I'm going to ask Dr. Williams to say a few words before we have the good of your hand. Amen. I just want to give God thanks again and for your relatives who are here um, this afternoon. Um, just cheer up and um, go through. The important thing is that you are alive. It's sad that your friend gone or your brother or your father that gone, but you're alive. And the Bible said, a living dog is better than a dead lion. So, you know, you, you have hope. Amen. There is hope for you. Um, the, the rich man. You know this story about the rich man and Lazarus, right? When, when Lazarus died and the rich man died, I believe Caiaphas and many of his colleagues have a big party for him. He maybe celebrated highly. But he could say, Jesus could say about him, that while they were having party and celebration, he, he, he was crying in hell. You see that? Party having her weeping in hell. Right? And, um, and, and he said, send me just to talk to my brothers to tell them that to come to this place. There is a place called hell. There is a place called heaven. And you are on your journey to go to one of these places. Amen? And I will in encourage you. Encourage you. Put your hope, your trust, your confidence, not in things but in Jesus Christ. Amen. Pray the name of the Lord. Amen. He is coming back again. Amen. 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 And you will have to answer to him. Yes. Every knee shall bow and every tongue will confess Amen. that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of his Father. Remember, it is he that had been us yes. and that we have ourselves. We are our people. The Bible said in, in Revelation, you know, that he made us for his glory yeah. to have pleasure. Amen. Amen. So, don't let us play with our life and play around with it. It's very important. The, the, the prodigal sons, when he came to himself, yeah. I tell you the truth, we are men and both men. It takes some of us long to come to ourselves, you know, yeah. and to our senses. That's true. The man, when he spent out everything, but when he came to his senses, yeah. He said, oh my God, look how much I am a servant of my father. And I am here stopping. Yes. He said, I will really arrive and I will go to my father. Amen. I believe now is the time for us to come to our senses. Yes. Praise God. And just get up and move forward to Amen. our father. Yes. Because I'm telling you the truth, Virgin. Praise God. When the going get rough and get tough and our back against the wall, I know who we're going to come to. When man fail and when women fail and when everything has failed, yeah. I know where you're going to go. You're going to call to the one. Amen. Pray the name of the Lord. Who will be around when you need him. So seek him the Lord when he will be found and call upon him. Thank you for hearing these words in Jesus' name.
happening at this time. I pray in the name of Jesus that the spirit of love, the spirit of forgiveness, the spirit of kindness, the spirit of gentleness, we undergird this family, O oh God, because the truth be told, oftentimes we stray from the path and we stray from the fall. But you have forgive us, help us to forgive one another. And I pray, God, that whatever differences that may be the family, whatever hurt that may be in the family, at this point, O oh God, they may see the wisdom, the virtue of coming together to support one another in bereavement. I pray that you cover them now, Lord, beneath the blood stain by. But as they leave from here and wherever part they may be, they will begin to unite as one. Bless this congregation in the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.
but a short time to live and it's full of misery. He comes up and comes down like a flower. and ashes to ashes looking for the general resurrection the last day and the life of the world to come through our Lord Jesus Christ at whose second coming in glorious majesty to judge the world the earth and the sea shall give up their dead and the corruptible body of those who sleep in him shall be changed and make like unto his glorious body according to this mighty working whereby he is able to subdue all things unto himself. Praise the name of the Lord. We will now sing. You have this song. Ready? You have this song. So singers, singers you can help us with the sing while the workmen men are doing their part. If you miss me, we are going to sing the chorus. Okay, we are going to sing some chorus. Let's do some choruses now. If you miss me, so everybody can join. If you miss me, don't come searching. If you miss me, don't come searching. So fast, don't find me. Wait, man, time.
to live stream so I'm do my work. No, they are video to the family member
Byron! Byron! I stay no longer with you. I made up some mind. Go God's way the rest of my life. I made up my mind. Go God's way the rest of my life.
Yeah, 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 I would say that. I have done some man or nothing. I call it police. I call it police and iron. Yeah, 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 yeah,
Gabke, Sengar, Sengar, Sengar.
gentlemen in a dignified way and we thank God for you all this afternoon the family appreciate your coming together to support them in this time of bereavement and as we are about to go I'm going to ask you that we bow our heads right now as we ask God blessing in severing one from another that you have brought us together and for this occasion to support the family in their time of bereavement. We now pray, Almighty God, that the soul of your departed son may rest in peace and may the light of glory perpetually shine upon him as we pronounce this benediction now unto him that is able to keep us from falling and to present us faultless before the throne of his glory with exceedingly great joy to the only wise God our Savior to him we ascribe majesty dominion and power both now and forevermore and we all say amen, amen. amen. god amen. bless you good afternoon after the time good afternoon thank you very much sir and the very same to you sir yes sir god go thank, thank you very much thank you very much thank you very much thank you very much thank you thank you thank you thank you very much
Everybody knows.